Hi guys, it's Sam and I am going to be doing a haul video and I'm just going to get started because I feel like I have quite a few things, not as much as last time, but I still have a few things. And the first item I'm going to show you is from the Adidas store and I was not planning on getting these. These were actually a birthday gift. They are a pair of sneakers and the ones, the sneaker that, sneakers that I currently love are the Nike Flyknits. They're just, you know, they have so many versions of those and the thing about those, which I love, they are super comfortable. They have gotten two big holes at the big toe and on the sides of my pinky. And I, it's on both shoes too. And they look terrible. I feel not, not completely embarrassed, but it's just like every time I look down, I'm like, oh, these holes. So I needed a new pair of shoes. And uh, so these are what these look like. They're called the Ultra Boost, and they're apparently very popular. I don't know much about shoes or sneakers. I mean, much about sneakers. Uh, but they're black, and, and there's a little bit of gray in there. But I, they're so comfortable. Uh, they are on the pricier side, but they were a birthday gift, so I am very thankful. And I have to wear these because they, they don't really need much of breaking in, but... It's time for me to say goodbye to the sneakers with the holes in them. And I'm not going to get rid of those shoes, but I'm not going to wear them if I go to places or work or things like that. I'll just wear them at home or if I'm going to the park or something. Uh, next is actually another pair of sneakers. And I think these are the most sneakers I've ever bought at like a close proximity of time to each other. And this is from the Nike store. And... I think this is a Nike outlet. It was at Jersey Gardens. I just saw these and I thought they were so cute. Now I don't really wear colorful sneakers, uh, but these and these aren't that colorful. They're kind of like a heathered look, so they have some color. There's pink and orange, and and I know that I just talked about Nike and how those shoes have have gotten holes in them, but I feel like this is a bit more concentrated. The other ones were. I don't know, more thready, but this one isn't as thready, if that makes any sense. And I thought these were just so cute. So, um, yeah, I'm excited to wear these sneakers. Um, I'm definitely going to bring one of these to Florida with me, I think. Yeah, I definitely will because I'm going to be wearing sneakers on the way to the airport. So those are the two sneaker purchases. And then next is a pair of jeans. And you guys know I love Style & Co., my there's a pair of jean, black jeans that I've had that I should have gotten rid of a long time ago, and I and I didn't want to part with them. And they were starting to kind of rip near the back area and backside area, and I sold them. And then they were just it was no saving them. So I had to I want to get another pair of black jeans because the other ones that I have sort of faded. So I got I just got another pair of Style Co skinny jeans and I think this is the curvy fit. Uh, but I love the Style Co jeans. If you haven't tried them, give them a try. They're they have different styles. If you're not into the skinny jean, they have boot cut, straight leg, and I feel like they're very very comfortable. Uh, I also got another pair of black jeans, but this is Levi's and they're the 535 super skinny. And, um, yeah, you know, just regular black jeans. I thought I would give these a try as well. And um, they feel very comfortable, too. Also from Macy's. And then, this is for Florida. And I am so excited. Because I have eyed this before when I was at Macy's. It's uh, The brand is Magic Suit. And I have a few other bathing suits from there, but this one I feel like is the most stylish one that I've seen them make. Uh, and it looks like this. I love this color, by the way. Just love it. Um, so this is the front, and it's kind of like a halter top, and then the back, I feel, is so beautiful. So there's kind of like that geometric kind of thing going on, and then just there's a little bit of ruching, but not too much on the sides. So love the color, and I was so excited to see um, they had it in my size. So very, very nice, and I'm excited. That's one of the bathing suits I'm going to wear. I don't know how much swimming I'm going to do. I want to go to the beach and 
there's a hair right there um, I want to go to the beach and we do have a pool in the house that we're renting and I'm sure the hotel so what I'm doing is I'm staying at a hotel for the first night that I'm there and then the two other nights I'm gonna be at kind of like an Airbnb sort of place and both of them are have pools and uh, we're near beach so I do plan to go swimming but I don't know how much I want to bring at least two bathing suits okay next let's see Oh, so this is from JC Penny. A few few things, and it so happens, you know, I found my the dress that I'm gonna wear for the wedding, and then I went to Nordstrom and they had this dress with tassels, and I'm like, oh my god, that is so cute. But I'm gonna stick with the dress that I have because I really like it. But I did want to get something with tassels, so I saw this at JC Penny, and it says bright coral color and I love the tassels and it it could be off the shoulder or you could wear it like one shoulder or um just put it up a little bit and the brand is Anna I believe yeah Anna and this is a new approach I never knew that I always thought it was Anna just Anna that makes sense a new approach uh but it's just very flowy and I feel like I could definitely use this in Florida but I mean I didn't just buy it for that uh so there's that pretty shirt then i don't know when i'm gonna use this but i just thought that this was so cute these are cat ears i'm more of a dog person i definitely like cats but i thought this was so cute so i um uh, sorry an alarm came up on my phone so i thought i would maybe wear this for halloween or just you know animal day at school or whatever uh next is these socks they are um the liner socks and the brand is mix it so everything is oh i didn't show you tell you the brand for this is carol inc the sort of in the kids section uh and these socks so you get a nude and a black and then i thought this pineapple print was so cute hopefully they'll stay on they look they have this thing on the um the ring right here it looks like it might stay on i don't know sometimes i have bad luck with those kinds of socks uh, then, let's see, this is Walmart, and I think I have something else from Walmart that I will show you. Uh, so, my sister was at, in California for a wedding, and she brought me back some things from Daiso, which I've never been to, but, um, it's a Japanese, I think, dollar store, and she got me push bottle type tube bottles, which will really come in handy for my vacation. Uh, slash wedding and then this is oil blotting paper which again perfect for Florida because it's gonna be so hot uh, then this is the hand mask pack which I will do after Florida do you guys know that I did the baby foot or it was a variation of the baby foot but it was much more concentrated and now I'm getting nervous because I did it two weeks ago and I thought that would be enough time for me to um, for me to for it to be done before I go to Florida. But I'm hoping that it's done. I think it's 90% done. But I just keep on looking down. And I'm so embarrassed. Because I've been wearing open toe shoes. And I'm just like. Oh people have to see that. Hopefully they won't say anything. Which nobody has. But it's so gross to see that on someone's foot. Uh, then here is this bag. Sorry. I don't know what I'm going to use this for. But it looks kind of like a laundry bag. But it's so cute. It has the Minnie Mouse on there. And then she brought me back, this is Coffee Nut m and I thought they were just regular m and and then she's like, did you notice they were coffee? So I can't wait to try those. And then a bunch of Asian candies, which I love these. These are the, there's some high chews in there. And then this is the Milkita. Love those. Hold on one second. So I don't know why I told you to hold on. I could have just paused the video, uh, which I was actually what I was doing. Um, so I went to, this is Target, and I saw that they had, I mean, this has been out. Oh, I have nowhere to put this stuff. Hold on one second. Okay. So this is the bronzer palette, and I was initially going to get, they had this highlight palette, but I looked at it, and I didn't love the colors in there. And I've been really into contouring, so I thought I would try this. And I love these, the palettes that look like this, so I thought I would try this one. Although the highlight won't look like this, too. So you get two mattes and two shimmers. So excited to play with those. 
And then I've always wanted to try this. Ever since I started watching YouTube and the Pixie Woo Girls, uh, this is the Embryo Lease Lay Creme, Conce Creme Concentrate. And this is a travel size one and I figured why don't I try why don't I try the travel size one first before I get the full size so people use they use it as a primer and my skin since I've been doing so a new I've been on this new acne medication is a little bit drier so any more moisture is a good thing Plus, extra moisture is a good thing and again with because of my skin this is the aquaphor healing ointment the one that I had was expired so the doctor tells the, doc, the dermatologist told me to use this topical ointment and it dries out your skin to mix it with a little bit of aquaphor. Next, they had, Target had a, oh, you know what, before I show you all that. Uh, this is the Vichy Lip, Lip Active Serum 10 Supreme. And I've been trying to be extra good about my skin and um, getting older, you know, my skin. Not that I have tons of wrinkles on barely any um but you know i've been doing moisturizing and doing all these steps like essences and serums and things like that for the last couple of years and this is just another one that i'm going to try and then before we get on to the essence stuff which i feel like target just started selling essence i don't know i just feel like it just appeared one day uh this is the nyx soft matte lip cream in seoul and you know i'm from south korea so i thought i would try this and i love I have a secret love for purple lipsticks. They might not look that great on me, but I really do like them. And so for the Essence, there was this, it's called Essence Blush Up Powder Blush in Heat Wave. And look at this color. It goes from, it's an ombre of orange to uh, peach and then like hot pink. So I can't wait to try that. Let me open it up. Isn't that gorgeous? So I might have been attracted by the packaging. And then next is this Pure Nude Highlight. And this one is in my Be My Highlight. And I'm just gonna... So let's just put some... I already had highlight, but on camera things fade away, so... I got that to try and then this is the essence I love I love stage eyeshadow and is there a color? I don't know. But I'm always trying eye bases and primer, so hopefully that'll be a good one. And it's a colored one, which I I feel like I like those better than just a non-colored one just because um, I don't put foundation in my eyelids just because they're so oily. And I feel like I said just because a million times. Okay, uh, then again, the last thing from Target, which is this big Vaseline Advanced Repair Lotion. And I know I just got the Nivea one, which I really do like, but I forgot how thick this was. So I want something a little bit thinner for the summertime. In the wintertime, I don't care how thick the uh, lotion is. Well, that's not true. I don't want it super thick, but I mix my lotions anyway with a little bit of oil um but i don't want to do that so this one it says non-greasy lotion and so i'm gonna start using this for the summertime or right now and then from from walmart i picked up this is the biore charcoal pore strips and they're Whenever you can see things that come off your face, it's always so fascinating yet disturbing at the same time. I know I'm going to sound like I'm humble bragging, but whenever I do BR strips, I don't see anything. So the fact that this is black and I see more things gets me really happy. So I got those and then oh, it almost fell out. And then this is the Milani Stay Matte liner in coffee matte and it says 17 hour wear i don't know i saw an advertisement for it and i love the milani infinite liquid eyeliner that's probably my absolute favorite uh, but this is matte and i thought i would try it and i got my sister the black she loves it so i'm excited to try these i don't know if i don't think her lids are as oily as mine so we'll have to see if this breaks down and that is it i today is saturday june 3rd I leave in about five days, which I am so excited for my friend's wedding. And it's just going to be exciting. It's Friday night. She's going to be having this kind of henna party. 
and then Saturday is a wedding and it's just gonna be an awesome time I'm super excited and let me know what you guys are up to for me school is almost over I can't believe I'm saying that it's about it's four more weeks but there's like a couple of days that we have off and of course I am not gonna be um here for a few days it's just that's how it worked out and it's almost over so yeah let me know how you guys are doing i hope everybody is well and i'll talk to you soon bye